this lesson brings up a very crucially important concept in lymph node pathology and lymphomas in general. Remember, we've already said a million times that in order to diagnose a lymphoma, you need a effacement of a lymph node. Well, I should have said 100% effacement because yes, sometimes in very early stages, if you're lucky, perhaps only part of a lymph node is lymphoma, but for all practical purposes, 90 something percent of the time, the whole lymph node is destroyed in a lymphoma or effaced, I should say. Well, the reason why we're gonna have a little problem with this case is because guess what? We do see some follicles with germinal centers out towards the periphery. We do see a subcapsular sinus. It looks like the northwest third of this lymph node could very easily be kind of normal, but the other two thirds is effaced by these cells. So is this a lymphoma? Well, I already told you it probably isn't because this usually doesn't happen. So what else could it be? Well, let's look and quit theorizing and figure it out for ourselves. Let's look in this area, which I hope will come to focus pretty soon. in the area that was uh, effaced, in which we do not have the normal uh, lymph node architecture. And notice that, yeah, there's a lot of cells that look like lymphocytes, but are there any other kinds of cells? And you will soon see that even though the majority of these cells look kind of lymphoid, take a look over here and here. Could these be perhaps some other kind of cell? Let's take a look at these darker, more irregular cells and go to their highest power. And I think I could convince you that these are probably not uh, lymphocytes or histocytes of any time, of any sort, they have more of a cohesiveness. They have other features of malignancy. So actually, this is a case of metastatic carcinoma to a lymph node, which would explain why the lymph node is partially effaced, because most metastatic carcinomas do not involve entire lymph nodes. You could see areas of normal lymph node architecture perhaps being effaced by little groups of metastatic cells coming in, but the opposite is true in lymphomas. In lymphomas, they're almost always 100% effaced. And it doesn't matter if this was breast carcinoma. I could tell you it was any adenocarcinoma. You'd probably believe me. And so would anybody else, because all I could say is these cells are malignant. They're kind of interspersed with the uh, lymphocytes. And this is not a lymphoma at all. This is metastatic breast carcinoma. Let me click on another couple areas here and hope I could focus in better. And yes, I can. And in this area, all around here, you see lymphocytes. But in all areas around here, you see metastatic carcinoma. These cells would have epithelial markers, whereas all of these cells would have lymphoid markers. Thank you very much.